Monday. Uh, it's interesting. It's the beginning of the new week, but it's uh, also the ending of the month. So tomorrow will be the last day of July. So usually I encourage uh, people to do the monthly review at the end of each month in order to be clear on what activities brought you customers in, what activities were money generating uh, activities, and it's important to know. And also what I wanted to focus on during this conversation is on visibility. And I don't know whether it's visible. I put on high visibility jacket and it's about to talk how visible you are to your future customers, to people who need your services. Before I go into the details, my name is Inga Dexner and I help small business owners to use social media in order to attract more customers and more importantly to enjoy running their businesses. The reason um, I, it's kind of symbolic in terms of uh, because we are talking about visibility and also, okay, let's face it, even though I'm not the most uh, slim person, far from it, that it's not flattering at all and it feels uncomfortable. But this is to demonstrate my point that yes, being visible sometimes will feel uncomfortable and you need to accept it. And this is, you can't imagine how big step this is for me uh, to, to demonstrate this outfit, which makes me like twice as big as I'm already are. But my point is, you need to go through the uncomfort because it's not about me, it's not about you it's about people we are meant to serve and if we need to go through a little bit of being uncomfortable let it be because if it makes you stand out and makes you visible to people who desperately need your help it doesn't matter so i think i made my point and it's a little bit hot in in this but uh, the idea is that it doesn't matter whether you feel uncomfortable or not um, and it's also important for me to walk my talk. I can't, ex uh, you know, ask my customers, or, so, you know, do it anyway, forget about your discomfort, if I don't uh, follow my own advice. My point is that it's exactly uh, to, to, to feel discomfort, but also to take your out from equation. And before I go into monthly review uh, part, I wanted to remind you that there are places available for high wide visibility session, which is where I tune into what's going on for your business and find uh, the best possible solution for you to get the visibility at the, at the same time uh, not to be exposed, right? So it is a little bit outside your comfort zone, you know, so what if you saw me like a, a big yellow caterpillar just uh, uh, two minutes ago, that's fine. Uh, probably I wouldn't do anything more uh, daring as that. So it needs to be a middle ground before uh, outside your comfort zone, but at the same time, it still needs to be um, enjoyable. So there is a link uh, in the description uh, or um, in the comments below, wherever you watch this video. But I want you to book your high wide visibility session. Why? Uh, because I also use my intuition and I do it as a demonstration um, to, to, to showcase how I work with clients. It's not about uh, follow these steps you will get this too, but it's about tuning into your personality, tuning into your business and find the best solution and also getting message from, from my uh, higher um, intuition so that this is where high vibes come in. And because it's um, experimental, because it's a case study uh, material, 
Uh, I'm offering it just for £30 for 30 minutes and around uh, eight people already taken, so only 22 places left. So please make sure that you book. You don't need to take it. So you have around a month to take it uh, um, and, and use the session. Now let's talk about monthly reviews. So do you know which of the social media platforms was the most profitable platform for you? And it's okay to admit that none of the platforms um, actually made you money. It's fine. Uh, it, what it means that next month, so uh, you choose one platform and you do the right steps. I can help you to find the right steps. I can help you to find the right platform if you have difficulties with that. But just tune in which one you feel most drawn to and uh, be consistent. So whatever platform you choose and you show up there every day, you will get successful. But also, it's not about social media. Social media will be like a magnifying glass. If you don't have systems in place, then no matter how often you do your live streams, how often you post your post, if you don't have a foundation in place, you know, you can be on social media as, as long as you want. It won't get um, any results. So make sure that you have systems in place. So you have an offer uh, or you have a free giveaway where people sign up for, for your um, email list. And then you, you can be consistent in inviting people uh, in, in, into, your, into your systems. Now, if you look at all your activities in July, uh, how active you were on other people's posts. And it doesn't matter where, so you choose which one you prefer. So let's say if you want engagement on, on your Facebook page or if you want engagement on your Instagram account, on your Twitter, on LinkedIn, ask yourself and be very honest with yourself how much did you spend to engage with other people's content? Like leaving the comments, starting the discussion, or uh, just sending a message saying, you know, seeing what you've done, uh, really impressed, uh, good luck in the future. Just very nice message without any hidden agenda. But it's about building a relationship. So, this is what I would encourage you to do. Uh, look very honestly and use the, all the um, insights or statistics of your social media platform. It will show you. So numbers don't lie, I'm afraid. So if you don't have enough reach, it means you need to change the tactics how you post or even to consider using Facebook ads. Or if you don't have engagement so think about whether it's because you don't have a reach or maybe because people are not interested in what you're offering or maybe there is no invitation for engagement do you ask questions do you um, you know encourage to to make it easy uh, to engage with your post so you need to be honest I think this would be my main main message for uh, for today like honestly look at what's going on on your social uh, media platforms. And I really liked uh, when I participated in training with Lewis House and Jasmine Starr, and she was using the phrase saying that uh, people are either on social media or people are using social media. In order to be successful, you need to use social media. And again, my invitation to you, it doesn't require much time it doesn't require any scientific approach it just uh, honestly look at your activities during the past month and um, without any judgment there is no point feeling bad about it just use it as matter of factly okay i did this and it didn't uh, bring any results or I didn't do anything to encourage people to, uh, you know, buy uh, buy my services or buy my products. So what will happen if next month I will make the offer? What will happen if I am more active 
in offering my services. And again, when I when I talk about offer your services, if you keep saying buy my stuff or um, I'm I'm selling this, chances are that people won't be interested. When you make your uh, when you make your offers, you need to take into uh, consideration why people would benefit. So you know it, and I know uh, you know for for my services that it make uh, all the services make well. I'm talking about your services and my. Um, I'm not saying all services, but um, if you are a conscious entrepreneur, uh, heart centered, and, and and so on, your services bring difference, uh, um, bring results. So, but people don't know it. So you need to present so it's crystal clear for them how you can help them and why they need to sign up with you now. Simple. You just need to. Um, step back and look at to your offer through the eyes of your potential customers again I'm saying that it's simple and it's much simpler for somebody who's not so involved in your business to look at your business and uh, tell you what needs to be um, tweaked to you so thank you so much for joining me and um, uh, let me let me oh show you for those of you who join me later I will dress back. So this was a session about high visibility it, to be aware, visible to your potential customers and it's very very uncomfortable but I did it twice so if I could it could have done it so so do you. Uh, be outside your comfort zone, enjoy being outside your comfort zone and serve people who need your help. On this high note, um, have a nice evening and I will talk to you very soon.